Okay, I, I just got done watching um, Black Mirror, uh, Archangel, so. kind of on accident. I went over to Netflix to check something else out. So rare, so rare. And I was like, oh, Black Mirror, oh, probably new predictive programming stuff, maybe I'll check that out. <laughs> so, you know, I watched the first episode with the creepy sociopath guy in his video game world. Whatever. Then I watched the next episode with the chips. Fucking implants. Fuck's sake. For fuck's sake. That is the last thing I want to see them normalizing. Ugh. Fuck. As someone who has had an implant removed from their body and who has at least one more, I think five, but at least this one in my fucking ear for sure. I, I, I hate to see them normalizing it and you know, I, I always thought that going the route of the employees getting easier access to work was not, that's not the smart route to do it. Go for the parents. Go for the parents who are afraid they're going to lose the kid. That's the smart way to do it. Just like people chipping their dogs. Heart strings. You want to get people to do something new and fucking crazy? Heart strings. Or fear same thing really when it comes down to it it all comes from the same place you know it's like all the shit they got us to do after 9-11 it was all fear and heartstrings all tied up into one big old fucking ball yeah it was fucked up it was a fucked up fucking episode man it was really fucked up the sick fucked up control that this mother had over this kid like I mean she spent the first half of her life having anything that stressed her out slight anything that raised her cortisol level basically became pixelated and you know it, like her mom could watch everything on a tablet and just like that whole thing of like people being able to see through my eyes like that just mmm such a mind fuck for me. It's fucks my head really bad. Really bad. Yeah. It's really fucked up. And then she's supposed to retire it, you know, and let the girl fucking grow up, be normal, you know. And the first night as a teenager, she lies and isn't where she says she's going to be and doesn't come home on time. She digs it out, turns it on, and gets to see her having sex for the first time. Yeah. That's what you get. That's what you get. It was so fucked up. It was so fucked up. Oh. I want my life before that episode back. But... I knew, I knew, and I said that not only were we going to see more predictive programming with the, uh, with AI, but with implants and chips for various different reasons. Yep. This is super normal, guys. It's super normal. Super normal. Chip your dog, chip your kid, chip your wife. Why not? Mm. 
I'm so fucked up. So now I have to watch the rest of the season and see what other shit they are putting out to people, you know, because, you know, I mean, sadly, we know that, I mean, and I'm not, most of the time I'm not speaking of the dead entities when I say this, I mean, just the people who aren't awake or quite there yet, um, they aren't going to see all these things, you know? They're not gonna see that they're trying to normalize stuff like chipping someone against their will, <laughs> but justifying it because you think it's what's good for them, or, you know, giving your daughter a fucking morning after pill just in case putting it in our smoothie, just in case. Oh, fuck. Yeah. So, yeah. I was disturbed by that. Which, if I'd known what I was walking into, I would have said, of course, I'm going to be disturbed by that. <laughs> of course I am. I know there's people who still think I'm full of shit. I don't care. I don't care what people think about me. What people think about me is none of my business. Except when they leave it in the comments and then I have to like look at it or reply to it or ignore it or whichever option I choose at that moment. Most time I just ignore it if it's mean. So you know, don't really give you the time of day if you say mean stuff. So don't bother thinking up anything too witty. Kind of pointless. I guess I'm gonna go see what the next episode. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm gonna go back to YouTube where it's safe. <laughs> where I know how things are. Yeah. Super fucked up. Super fucked up shit. Ding. Ding. Loves ya.